Hi, in this video from tvtrade.ie we're basically going to show you how you can format an external drive such as a memory stick or an external hard drive from NTFS to FAT32. So the reason that you might want to do this is a lot of devices such as satellite receivers, terrestrial receivers, even Xboxes or Playstations, if you're going to use an external hard drive or memory stick with them, they would prefer that you have it formatted to FAT32 okay but the problem is that a lot of devices especially um, external hard drives um, come formatted by default as NTFS okay so the next issue with that then would be over a certain size Windows won't give you the option to actually format it to FAT32 okay so you need to use an external program to do this and the program I'm going to use in this video is called the AOMI partition assistant and it's a standard edition version 5.2 and this program is freely available on the internet from websites such as download.com where you can download it and use it for free okay so I have it open here and you can see that you can see all the drives that are currently in my system here at the moment okay so what I want to show you here is basically it's the F drive which is just a little memory stick I have plugged in here at the moment for demonstration purposes I have it highlighted there and you can see that the file system is currently NTFS so I'm just going to go back here now and um, we'll show you how to use it okay so remember it's the F drive and you always want to be careful which drive you're actually formatting okay because you know you could end up wiping you know of important information or something like this okay so I'm just going to highlight it here and it's given me an option here in the wizards which is very convenient of it's just a button NTFS to FAT32 converter now you can do this manually and basically you know do this um, <coughs> excuse me step by step but the wizard for people that aren't sure what they're doing is very very handy okay so we're just going to click on the button here and it's going to come up here now and it gives me two options it's going to say what you call it, um, NTFS to FAT32 or FAT32 to NTFS. So I know it's already NTFS and I want to go to FAT32 and that's ticked already, so that's what I'm going to select. But alternatively, if you wanted to go the other way from FAT32 to NTFS, you could just click on that. Okay, so I'm just going to select NTFS to FAT32 and click next. So remember, it was the F drive that we're after. Okay, now it may be different on your system. It could be DEF, it could be anything. But you just want to make sure and how the, the easy way I know apart from, you know, the name of the drive and the letter of the drive is you should double check and make sure the size of the drive that you're doing is the correct one. So they're just little, you know, hints to show you you're actually doing the right one. So I'm going to select the F drive here, click next and it just comes up and gives all the usual disclaimer and covering themselves okay so that's fine so we want to convert from ntfs to fat32 the drive letter is f the label was usb and the total size is 1.87 gigabytes so it says it's ready to collect uh convert the f partition so what we're going to do is just simply click proceed we're about to execute yes and there we go so uh it's doing it fairly quickly there as you can see and it couldn't be easier really uh, so now it's converted it to um, FAT32 so what we're going to do is we're just going to go back here and you can see that my F drive now has become FAT32 so what I'm going to do next is just cancel here and bring back up the actual uh, menu system for the Adomi AOMI partition to, uh, partition assistant okay so what we're going to do then is just demonstrate you going the other way so we're already at FAT32 so we'll click the NTFS to FAT32 converter and we're going to go from FAT32 to NTFS and we we'll click next so we want to select the F drive that's the correct one we we'll click next we we'll click proceed are you sure yes and it comes up the program is working please wait and it'll just go through the process and come back at the end when it's finished so it just takes a few seconds so it may take a little bit longer on a bigger drive but you know you can see it's a fairly easy process so it says it succeeded in converting it to NTFS we click OK we we'll click finish and we'll click cancel there and just exit out of that wizard and we'll come back there now and what we can do is if we go back into my computer we can see that the F drive now is NTFS so that's basically it in a nutshell um, how you can convert an external USB device uh, from FAT32 to NTFS or vice versa.